Who is that person who is not a believer? The Prophet Sassam said, Man yashba wajaru ila jambi ijae. He who is to his feel while his neighbor is hungry. Such a person is not a believer. And we say, yeah, you are like the and you will say, naam. The Prophet Sassam also told the companions one day, please listen to this. You can judge yourself whether you have actually become a true believer. The Prophet Sassam said, Atadruna maha kuljar. Do you know your duties to your neighbors? They said, we don't know. The prophet said, In istansaraka nasarta, if he seeks your assistance, assist him. Wa in istaana bika aanta, if he seeks your support, support him. Wa in istakradaka akrata, if he, if he borrows from you, lend him. Wa in marido otta, if he falls sick, visit him. Wa in mata shayata janazata, if he dies, witness his funeral. In asaba o khairun anata. If anything good happens to him, felicitate with him. If calamity befalls him, commiserate with him. Do not cause him any harm. Do not allow your house to be tall in such a way that it will prevent fresh wind from reaching him. Except with his permission. If he buys, if you buy only one apple, only one fruit, give him out of it. If you know it's not going to be convenient for you to give him, then bring it in secretly. And do not allow your own child to take it out to oppress his own children. And do not oppress him with the aroma of the food you cook unless you have an intention of giving them out of it. Who told you you are one of them? May Allah make us, may Allah make us true followers of Muhammad. So the Prophet taught, this, this is just one of the several teachings he gave to his people in medina he taught them he raised a community of believers they were equipped to conquer the world and they didn't conquer the world by the sword they conquered with high and lofty moral qualities they conquered with high intellectual acumen they conquered the world with their conduct and as a result wherever they went they were able to set up the flag of islam and